Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, can you hear me? Hello, hello, hello. Is anybody there? Hello, can you hear me, everyone? Hello, teacher. Hello, how nice are to you? See you again, teacher. Yeah, my pleasure. How are you? Fine, very happy. I'm happy to start to to talk a lot of English. <laughs> that's the idea. That's the idea. Remember that that's the purpose here and intermediates levels is that you talk a lot. Okay. I'm really happy to see you guys. I didn't expect this. I mean, it's not usual to, you know, to have like the same group, like in different uh, courses, but I'm really happy to see you here again. So let's see who else is here. I can see Nelson. Hello, Nelson. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Hi, hi. You, hey. how are you? I'm happy. I'm happy to see you again. It's so, a pleasure, teacher. Thank you. Welcome to the class. And I can see Erica, of course. Hello, Erica. How are you? Hi. I'm sorry. I was playing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But how nice are you? Nice to see you again. I'm fine. Very I'm good. I'm Actually, happy. Actually, I'm a little bronze. When, when, what happened? <laughs> I was on the beach this oh. last weekend. <laughs> Good for you. Which one? El Conchalillo, I, I guess. And, and where is that? <laughs> to, it's near to sun, the Sunset Park. It's pretty near. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I mean, Good for you. <laughs> <laughs> nice to see you again. My pleasure. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Who else? Who else has been in the beach? Anyone else? No, only Erica. Good. <laughs> Lucky girl. Okay, I can see Lucy too. Hello, Lucy. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. It's nice to see you again. Thank you. I'm glad to welcome to the class Thank and you. welcome to the say to the new level. Let's see. I can see Holman. Hello, Holman. How are you? Hello, Holman. Are you there? Hi, my teacher. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Uh, uh, I am fine. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's, it's good to see you again. Thank you. I'm glad to. So, everyone, welcome to the new level. Welcome to Intermediate 4. So, uh, again, the purpose for this level, remember, mm -hmm. We always have to talk a lot, okay? That's the idea for this level. Talk and learn new vocabulary. Remember, we always need um, to practice some grammar topics, so we will always do it. And you already know me, right? You know the way that I like to work. So remember, everybody, if you need... Um, a topic you you feel difficult that the topic is very difficult you can always tell me um, that you want a little review and we can take some minutes in the class so we can review them all right so uh, let's see i know that here we are going to have some new classmates too so for the ones that don't know me. My name is Clarissa and I'm Bri, your teacher. I'm totally happy to see you here. Now, let's see. Uh, just a reminder, guys, camera on, okay? 
Thank you for the one who has the camera on. The other ones, camera on, please. Remember, that's not optional, it's an obligation. Let me start sharing the presentation. Can everybody see the presentation? Yes, teacher. Yes? Excellent. Okay, today is May 15th. We are basically in the middle of the month, okay? And, well, for the ones who don't know me, uh, my name is Clarissa. I've been a teacher for around six years or more. I'm not even sure. <laughs> I lost the count, <laughs> but uh, I really love teaching. What I love, I mean, what I like the most is when I can see the improvement in my students. I love to see when they improve the issues and the areas that they feel difficult at the beginning, but then for they is easier. So, this is a new level, so we are starting the intermediate four. So just a reminder of the class rules. Remember, camera on during the whole class. In the previous level, I know sometimes you have some emergencies, sometimes you are sick, sometimes you are not at home, so you don't turn on the camera. And I told you that it was fine. So, but remember, if you are at home, if you don't have an emergency, camera on during the whole class, not only at the beginning, not only when I say it, but during the whole class. Because when Insafort check the videos, when Insafort check the classes, they can see some people with the camera on and the other ones don't. So they are asking why why they don't have the camera on. So basically, imagine that in the attendance, I said this person was in the class, but it's a first said, yeah, but that person didn't turn on the camera. So how can you prove that that person was, uh, I mean, truly in the class? So that is an issue, okay? So please keep the camera on. With your camera, you prove that you are here, that you are paying attention, that you are active, okay? Don't forget your full names on Zoom. I know that you already know this. I need you to write your full names exactly as in your doing. That's the name that I need to see on Zoom. Remember the attendance, it's, Real important, everybody. So please attendance. Uh, don't tell me, teacher, tomorrow I won't be in classes. No, you have to. Okay, so remember these levels are basically five weeks. So don't miss any class. All right. The attendance is really, really important. And if you want to get the 100% of attendance, remember that you had to be in the class 120 minutes every day. So if you connect for only 60 minutes, it's not enough. If you connect for 80 minutes, mm -mm, you are not going to get the 100%. So please respect the attendance, okay? Uh, is any question there? Is there any question about the attendance? Anyone? Or is it clear? Clear? Yes? Clear. Yes, clear. All right. And remember, no Spanish. I know there are some moments where we don't find the words when we don't know how to say something, but Remember that the idea is to avoid Spanish as much as possible. You are intermediate levels, so don't say anything in Spanish. Try to search for synonyms or try to change the idea in order that you can say it in full English. Now, um, you already know we have the platform, okay? So you have to work on the platform, please, every week. Remember, I will be checking your advanced. So at the end, you need to get minimum the 80%, all 
okay? But in this level, I expect 100% in all of you, okay? Not the 80, I want the 100%. Um, every week, I will check it, uh, your advance on the platform. Remember, every Friday, I will check your advanced. So you have to be, or you have to keep in mind that every Friday, you already finished a, one section of the platform, okay? That must be your goal. So is anybody here without the access to the platform or everybody is ready for that? Yes? Clear, teacher. Is anybody here who doesn't know how the platform works? No? Okay, let's see. There are some people that I don't know. For example, Miss Adriana Escalante. Hello, Adriana, how are you? Hi, good evening. Good evening, how are you? Very good. Happy to be here. <laughs> Very good. I'm happy too. Welcome to Intermediate Four. And I know that you are new in this group, but these guys, yeah. they are very friendly. Right, guys? Yes. Say hello to Adriana. Yes, <laughs> hello, Adriana. Uh, <laughs> nice to meet you. Hi. So, Adriana, they are very friendly. Welcome, if you... welcome, welcome. Very Thank good. <laughs> if you need help or if you have a question, believe me, they will help you. They are very friendly. Do you okay. have access already to the platform? Do you know yes. the platform? Yes? Yes. yes I Great. Am. Excellent. Okay, let's see. Who else? Who else is new? I, I know all of you. What happens is that some of you never turn on the camera, so that's why I, I don't recognize you. <laughs> no, who else? Who else is new? Anyone else? No? All right, I think all of you are here. Okay, if it is something, someone new, welcome, <laughs> okay? Now let's start. So everybody remember always work on the platform. That is not optional, okay? It's an obligation. Now, let's see. I think that there is someone new, Herman. Herman Alexander, hello, Herman. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. How, how, how about you? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Welcome to Intermediate Four. Thank you. Okay, Herman, uh, you are new in this group. So yes. no worries. These guys are friendly. Everybody say hello to Herman. Hello. Hello. Hello, Herman. Hello. Hello. All right. So, Herman, if you need help, if you have a question, just let us know and we'll be there for you, okay? Okay, thanks. Do you know the platform? Do you have access already to the platform? Yes. Excellent. Okay, so I think that everybody's ready. So let's start with the topic for today. We are in the week one. You need one okay so the first topic that we will talk about it's advantages and disadvantages of a distribution channel so what is that well we are going to discover it here in the class but first of all and before i forget i'm going to check attendance so everybody when you listen to your names say present adrian escalante present okay Carlos Abrego. Present, okay. uh, let's see, let's see. Christian Alexander. Present, teacher. Okay. Erika Yasmin. Present. Okay. Fatima Denise. Fatima mm. Denise is not here. Okay. Um, Herman Alexander. Present. Okay. Hector Francisco. Present teacher. Okay. Isabel Hernandez. Isabel Hernandez. Okay. Ivan Guzman. 
Presence. Okay. Jamie Escobar. Present teacher. Okay. Holman Giron. Present. Good. Lucy Natalie. Present teacher. Okay. Magdalena Escalante. Present. Okay. Mirna Elizabeth. Present. Very good. Nelson Antonio. Present. Okay. Oscar Armando. Present. Okay. And Rosalina Alvarado. Present, Miss. Excellent. Okay, everyone, let's start. Let me share the presentation again. Can everybody see the presentation? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. This is the class objective. I need a volunteer, please, for reading. Could I? Yes, please. Um, class objective. At the end of the class, participant will be able to identify different words related to the distribu distribution channels. Thank you. So we are going to learn about the distribution channels. Of course, we are going to learn vocabulary. And of course, you will talk a lot. Okay. And when we are talking about distribution channels, what comes to your mind? Mm -hmm. What comes to your mind when I say distribution channels? May I, teacher? Yes, please. I think, uh, for example, um, <clears throat> supermarket uh -huh. is a place when the uh, producer people put the, uh, the goods for sale. Very good, yes, very good, thank you. What else? I'm going to show you a picture and this is related to what Rosalina said. Distribution channels, what comes to your mind when you listen to that word? Yes, it's the t-shirt is, maybe it's the channel uh, when you have the distribution is the, the, the place. Uh, and the presentation that you have the, the your, your product for sale. Exactly. So imagine if you have a product, imagine that you want to sell shoes, you create the product. So then what you need to do, you need to sell the product. So this distribution channels means the place or the way, the process that you will use in order to sell that product. And we have different type of distribution channels like retail outlets or retail stores that are the typical stores that we know. We have the direct selling that is very common nowadays. We have the e-commerce. We are going to study that today. And we have the whole sales. Do you remember this word? Yes. <laughs> what is that? It's when you sell, uh, it's not retail, it's wholesale is in... No. Not in Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh -huh. so it's majority ma majority <laughs> it's not for <laughs> yes, the majority yes. yeah. so yeah. but look at this she tried she tried to avoid spanish that's good nice job so that is basically what we are going to be talking about and when we talk about retail uh, retail channels or distribution channels it's very important to talk about choppings right when we talk about this it's typical to talk about choppings do you like choppings guys yes or no yes of course yes of course yeah. <laughs> no yes, t-shirt <laughs> i don't know why i don't know why er, almost every girl says yes and yes. the guy is like ah uh. <laughs> or boys how about you do you like shopping Sometimes. I like shopping teacher. Yeah, sometimes. sometimes. Ah. <laughs> ah, you see, also boys liked it. Okay. Mm -hmm. What kind of things do you like to buy? 
closed. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, yeah, I, I liked it too. What else? Shoes, pajamas. <laughs> Makeup, right. shoes. Uh... <laughs> Makeup, Ivan. Uh, no, and you, and lady. <laughs> ah, <laughs> okay. Why not, teacher? Hey, Ivan. Wow, who do you make? Yeah. It's a diversity, it's a diversity live right now. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> people sell a lot makeup. Yeah, actually, we don't judge, right? <laughs> okay, let's see. Herman, you said that you like it. What kind of things do you like to buy? And shoes, too. Ah, okay, pretty good. Food. food, definitely. <laughs> Healthy food or junk food? Junk food. <laughs> okay, pretty good. Now, everybody, we are going to start this class speaking, okay? So we are going to discuss these questions to your classmates, all right? If you don't understand a question, we are going to search words on the dictionary. But I will help you with the number four. Look at the question number four. Volunteer for reading, please. Shoplifting is when someone takes something from a shop without um, paying. Paying? Paying. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what is shoplifting, everyone? Do you understand the term? No. <laughs> okay, imagine that you go to a store. Okay, and you see some pair of shoes <laughs> that you love it, but they are very expensive and you don't have money. So the store doesn't have cameras <laughs> and the managers, the sales, they are not paying attention. You have a, a bag, so you take the shoes, and run away without paying. <laughs> that is chop lifting. Okay? It's like when you are a thief. Yes? Is it clear the chop lifting? Yes. Yes? Yes. Yeah. All right. So, do you think that chop lifting is common in our country? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Have you ever <laughs> done that? No. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever considered to do that? No. 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 Right. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. I Have agree. you Have you ever seen someone doing it? Yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. Really? Where? Where? Where have you seen mm. someone? At the supermarket or? I don't know. I don't know if you remember, but when I was working in a, in a Gran Vía, mm -hmm. I was, I, I went to Simán to shop something. And I saw that old woman with a huge, uh, with a huge dress or with a huge skirt. And then we saw the police and it was like, what, what was happened? <laughs> oh my and god. Under the, the skirt, they were taking a lot of things. Okay. Oh my <laughs> goodness. All right. So that is the question. All right. Can you see the picture? Yes. This is, this is an example of chop lifting. Okay. So now we're going to discuss the questions with your classmates, okay? Try to give your opinion. Remember, zero Spanish. If you don't find the words, you have two options. You can search the word on the dictionary or say a synonym. So the idea is to avoid it, okay? I'm sending the questions on WhatsApp's group. Let me ask you, is everybody already on WhatsApp's group? Yes, everybody? Yeah. Okay, perfect. If someone is not in the group yet, let me know so I can add you. Okay, can you see the questions on WhatsApp's group? 
Yes? Yes. Perfect. Okay, everybody, let's practice the questions. Let me open up the groups. Please, everybody, enter to the breaking rooms. Okay, I want to see everybody participating. Okay, let's go. Hi. Hello. Hello, how are you? Hi, Maria, how are you? Good. <laughs> nice to see you again. Nice to see you too, and nice to see you, uh, Ariana. Oh, nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. <laughs> okay. Okay. Somebody Let's has the, the question there. If you want, I can read the, the number one. Uh, do you like shopping? <laughs> yes, yes, of yes, course. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> and you, Adriana, do you like shopping? Actually, no. <laughs> no, why? <laughs> well, because I'm always be stressed because I'm. It's hard to me to decide what I need to buy. So sometimes okay. I have a little, a little bit of stress buying. So I try to avoid. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's yes, the I'm first here. person that I know that is stressed with a job. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> because in my case, it's a distress. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> you relax. You, you're feeling relaxed by it. Yeah. yeah. In my case, yeah. yes. <laughs> uh, what but kind what of thing do you, do you buy? Uh huh. <laughs> Um, maybe it depends also because when I need to buy clothes or maybe shoes, I'm really stressed. But maybe if I need to buy food, no, mm. because I love food. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good thing. And you have I, the you have the idea that you do yes, one when yes. you go to the supermarket. Oh, yes, okay. it's correct. <laughs> but but clothes that is not the same. And in oh. your case. Oh, in my case, different kind clothes, medicine, <laughs> food, also, <laughs> and shoes. And for my kids, clothes too. Yeah. And you, Erica? <laughs> I'm still in shock. <laughs> <laughs> Why? This is the first. Is the first girl that I ever heard that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> go shopping, go to yeah. <laughs> For me, it's like I go to the psych, uh, to the um, psychology, psychology. psychology. So yeah. Like that, uh, it, 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 I don't know. It's, it's medicine, for me, it's a for therapy. Me, <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> Actually, yeah. I... so okay. Pencil. I saw the pencil. I I buy it because I like a lot of I don't know why, but if I have more, more money looking for a new pencil and buy it. I like to watch or, or like to see the that section in all the marketplace or or the supermarket. Uh -huh. The library section. Ah the like, yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like to visit Home Depot. And, and, and toys, in toy section also. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Okay, the second one. Have you ever spent too much money? What did you buy? How do you feel afterwards? What still? Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever spent too much money? Still worse. <laughs> Uh, okay. I start or uh -huh. Ivan? Go ahead, Christian. Okay. Mm, yes, I think uh, for me it was much, was much, but I don't know. I, I buy a, a shoes, mm -hmm. a pair of shoes, but I spend about mm, $100. Four hundred? No, one hundred. Ah, oh my goodness. One hundred. Mm -hmm. For one yes. pair of shoes? 
Yes. Oh my goodness. And I feel bad, but my mom said me that you have to buy that. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> For my 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 grade my graduation graduation uh -huh. graduation yes. mm -hmm. uh -huh. but it just for that time <laughs> maybe for impulse no mm, for oh, the for for, 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 <laughs> for uh -huh, for for the how oh, can I say for the situation no yes for for that situation but. Because it's a uh, unique, unique. Yes, mm -hmm. and uh -huh. I, I have, I have the shoes here. I use every Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you take care, take care of the shoes, no? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. Hi, Bob. Okay. Do you feel, man? How, how did you feel after uh, one? Uh, I think uh, usually I I I do that in in my birthday because it's like um it's like uh all year I am um, uh, say money I I I think I I I I try to to don't spend but. In my bird, in my birthday, I is is like is it's like um, yeah, yes, yes. In my birthday, so I I can if I can spend a lot, but uh, uh, after that, after work is like oh, I why why <laughs> do 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 you spend the. Uh, oh. but it's like it's okay. I in 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 this time, I I I can't. I I have the possibility, and it's my birthday. And, uh, but it's, it's or or, it's, or when is birthday your? Because uh, sometimes you 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 I I uh. You can't, but if you can, it's 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 okay because in my case I am, I am young. I am. I am you are single. I am you start, are single. Yes, I start to 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 live the life. It's it's okay for the mom, but uh, okay. I think I think uh uh after. Uh, after my, when I win a, a father, it's different situation. Okay, in your mother too. Okay, no problem. Your mom. Okay. Okay, uh, Lucy, can you hear me? Yes, and the other question is, think about an expensive thing that you bought. Was it worth the what you paid for it, Nelson? Oh, I, I have a lot of time that, do, that I noticed uh, bought uh, something spent. Maybe only when, when I have problem with my car and I need to buy a, a part. Only in, in guilty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm <I> guilty. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I saw the love and the order and, and, and use a, a lot this this word. Guilty or not guilty? I don't know the pronunciation. Guilty, I believe it's guilty. Guilty, ah. Or... I believe, I guess, I guess. I, teacher. It's correct. Guilty is correct. Guilty? Yes. Okay. 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 
The second is, have you ever spent two money? Mm, once I spent two money when I bought uh, a food. It was sushi, and I, I don't, I don't, I didn't like the the flavor. <laughs> and I feel guilty. <laughs> <laughs> and how about you? Oh, I have a problem with my with my computer. Um, I have you ever spent a lot too much money? I try not because it, it before or no, after. After is uh, I have the I feel guilty too when I I um, pay a lot for any 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 product and I when I I buy when I buy something. Is only for really, really. I need. I think, I need. And my strategic, I think, my uh, is don't have a lot, uh, buck <laughs> in my in don't my, in my buck. I think I, I don't know uh, uh, buck okay. money. Uh -huh. Okay. In, in my in my in my buck. Back, how how say uh, bolsillo? Wallet. In my I... wallet, aha. Uh -huh. In my in my in my wallet, I don't like uh, have a lot because it is easy to to buy any any stuff. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> not not necessary for my for my life. <laughs> okay. But I, I feel I feel so, uh, a lot of time. I feel a lot of time. No. Okay. I, I, I feel guilty too. Okay, it's a good strategy. <laughs> <laughs> but no, uh, when I have, I when I have uh, the debit card, uh, I I think like <laughs> iPhone twelve. iPhone twelve. Yes. Uh, One hundred. Is um. Miles? Yes, one hundred. One hundred. One hundred nineteen, I think. Okay, my limit for cell phone is uh, five hundred. My limit is my limit is. 300. Yes, too. <laughs> no more. Xiaomi. Xiaomi. I prefer I prefer Samsung. Okay. I prefer Xiaomi. I want to prove the iPhone. Never. <laughs> he is in other level of faith. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, next. Shoplifting. Who is that? What is that? What is that? Shoplifting is a rover. Still? Still. Who take out something without pay for it. Okay, I get it. How common is the crime in your country? In this year, I can see that. Really? How was that? I I haven't seen. I have not seen. I don't understand. I have not seen that. Yo no he visto eso. In this year. 
I am I have not seen that in my life. I I didn't see I doesn't I didn't see in a mall but in a stop bus I was near from a, a similar situation of mm -hmm. a crime. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. was common in, in the past uh, yeah no i i remember one uh, situation in the supermarket i saw the younger woman and pick up some make make makeup mm -hmm. and put inside the brassiere mm -hmm. and come walk walk mm -hmm. <laughs> and go outside the supermarket and i say oh my goodness I feel nerves only for mm -hmm. seeing that, but the ladies far away, very, uh, I don't know, say try, relaxing, try, <laughs> relaxing, yeah, and saying, mm -hmm. oh my goodness. But I don't know how, what happened with the cameras, mm -hmm. safe camera, maybe not is turned on inside the supermarket, or, I don't know. Or security. Mm -hmm. Or security people, yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sometimes I I walk inside the supermarket and saw behind me safe people and I'm I'm laughing because uh, all uh, the woman always like to walk and walk and walk inside the supermarket and then mm -hmm. I think the people when stall when when stall something pick up mm -hmm. and go out and then I don't know what happened with the safe. Okay, and you, Ivan? No, not really. The you shopping, never see that? Shopping fleet. No. In the in the El Salvador, uh, it's the practice is is <laughs> uh, ¿cómo se? se ve bastante. It's very common. It's very, very common. common. Yeah, right. Thank uh -huh. you. It's very common. Yeah. Yes. Tradition, maybe? Yes, I don't know if it's culture, custom. Uh, habit. Okay. It's a habit. Yeah. Habit. habit. Yes, maybe. No, but it's different. You have the culture. Costumbre. Yeah. I, I My exactly. traductor yes. say habit, <laughs> but I'm not sure. <laughs> if habit. I remember that it was custom. Custom, custom, something like that. And tradition? Culture. Maybe tradition? Custom. Because it's it's custom. custom, it's okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. Teacher, oh my God, you're a ghost. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> where, where, where? I'm where, a where? ghost. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Teacher, but when I translate, well, in Google Translate, say have it. I mean, what happens is that it's just synonyms. Mm -hmm. Remember that, what is a habit? Habit is an activity that you currently do like very frequently. What is a common, uh, sorry, what is a custom? Custom is an activity that you do regularly with a lot of frequency. So they are just synonyms. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. You. Do you finish all the questions? No, we... We, we were the in the last, last one. one. Yeah. Okay, you have one minute. Go ahead. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Or the ghost will hunt it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the last one says if you were to open your own shop, what kind of things would you like to sell? Wow. Adriana is getting stressed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't like the show. Relax. It's just a way. But that was good. I love food. The yeah, remaining. maybe food. You yeah. Love food. yeah. I like to work in my pocket. To, to prepare the food. Desert. I love desert. Sugar. <laughs> There's a really good Sugar and flowers. How about That's you? For Marina? me, maybe food is 
common that if you have a, <laughs> a shop, food or cafeteria, books. Yeah. Books. books. Yes. What kind of books? Every kind of book that, that, that book that you ever mind. Okay, time's up. We're going to go back to the main room. Time's up. Time's up, time's up. Let's go back to the main room, okay. Very talkative, guys. I like that, okay. Interesting questions, interesting answers. I like that. Easy or difficult, the questions, what do you think? Uh-huh. Interesting for me. Okay, very good. Everybody, how about you? Easy or difficult, the questions? It was funny. <laughs> <laughs> I know, you were laughing all the time. Every time that I got to your teams, you were laughing, girls. Okay. All right. Did you listen to any, word in, any words in Spanish? A few. All right. Ah, a few. Okay. And the a rest few. of you? <laughs> yeah, some words. Only some, some words? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Like like which ones? Tostada, okay, for yeah. example. <laughs> okay. And a partner is sin scrupulous. How do you say? Ah, okay. That's interesting. Did you search for it in the dictionary? No? no? No. Okay. Unscrupulously. Uncrus I'm going to send it in the chat. Okay. Remember it's every... travel, right? a little, but a it, little bit. Teacher, yeah. But it's it's the correct word. I think maybe it's a, a slang uh used more common slang in, in the USA. Not not for this this word scrupulous. <laughs> well, actually, um, basically, it's not like a slang, but we can use that one too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, remember that there are different options that you can use. For example, there are some people that instead of saying this word, they say like acting like outlaws. That is another phrase. Uh, I'm going to send it in the chat too. So instead of saying that, we can say that. Acting like outlaws. So a person that acts in this way is a person that doesn't follow the rules, doesn't follow the laws. So you can use that, uh, that phrase too, okay? Now, I was listening to the groups, everybody, I really liked, and this is something positive. I really liked that everybody were participating. When I entered to the groups, you were talking a lot. That's something that I really liked. So good job. Also, you were talking in English. I listened a couple of words in Spanish too, but only the difficult ones. The rest of you, you were doing a great job. So that's great, I loved it. Remember that the purpose here in the intermediate level is to speak a lot. Now, there are some details that we always need to keep in mind. So I have these phrases, please help me to correct them. Can I say, I choose? I listen to that in some groups. Can I say I no. choose? No. Why not? Because it's plural choose. Ah, so choose is in plural. We cannot say that. So remove the letter R. Okay. She said me. Can I say that? She said me. What do you think? 
She says. She told me. She said to me. Ah, so remember, you have two options. You can use the verb say, in this case, it's in simple past, said. But if you want to use say, you need to separate the verb from the object pronoun. And you will say, said to me. That is one option. Or you can use the verb tell. And you can say, she told me. With the verb tell, you don't need to separate them. Okay? As simple as that. Be careful. Now, next one. In my birthday. Is that correct? On my birthday. Ah, oh, prepositions. Be careful, be careful. Okay, what is the pronunciation of this word? Span. I'm sorry? Span. Ah, can I say spend? Can I say that? It's without E. Thank spend. you. So, spend. But sometimes I listen to this. Spend. I spend a lot of time. Be careful. We don't have a letter E, so we cannot say that. Okay, I was listening to this word. What is the pronunciation? Strategy. 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 Okay. And uh, brassiere, is that English or Spanish? Brassiere is in English. Spanish. What is it? English. Spanish. Actually, exactly. In English, it's just. Bra. It's Bra. shorter. It's, it's very common to make this kind of mistakes. But remember, Brazier, yes, that is Spanish. In English, it's easy. Only bra. Okay? Bra. Now, Could be underwear? Yes. Sure. What happens is that bra is specific, right? That you means to the top. But you can say that too. Now, we already practiced those questions. Now, everybody, let's talk for one minute. I will pick some people. You will answer the question, but you have to talk for one beautiful minute. No more, nor less, okay? No pauses, no hesitation, and of course, not Spanish, okay? I'm going to pick randomly, so no worries. Let me pick someone. Give me one second. Remember, only one minute, guys. It's very short time. Okay. The winner is... Ivan, wow, Ivan, you are lucky. Are you ready, Ivan? Ready, teacher. That's the attitude. Okay, Ivan, you have to answer the first question. Do you like shopping? And for what kind of things? One minute, go. Okay, uh, I, like, I like shopping. For example, shoes, clothes, um, uh, technology accessories uh, depending on the, the that are necessary in my in my days um i could be i could be um offer price in different uh, stores um i prepare a, a voucher for the bite um uh, only that. No, continue. Come <laughs> on. One minute. <laughs> okay. What else? Um, what about food? Ah, I like food también. I like food. Um, the Kai food. Um, pupusas, pizza, hamburgers. I love it. Pizza. <laughs> right. 
continue. Eight seconds. Mm, ¿Qué más, güey? Son... Uh, yeah. I remember. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Only that? Only that, teacher. Okay, good. You know, super good, Ivan. At the beginning, you started with a lot of fluency. I mean, you started to talk a lot, but just at the end, it's like you lost the ideas. You didn't mm -hmm. know what, what else to say. So try to practice this activity at home, okay? After the class or during your free time, try to speak a little bit more, okay? Thank you. Okay, next one. Mirna. Hello, Mirna. Hello. Okay. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing well. I'm nervous. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Have you ever spent too much money? What did you buy and how did you feel afterwards? <laughs> yes, I, I ever spent too much money. Uh, for example, when I buy a, a bag or something, uh, some uh, sneakers. Uh, and shoes or, or bags or, or perfume. I spent uh, uh, a lot of money um, and I liked <laughs> I, I, I like to spend in this product because I, I feel that this is necessary for me. <laughs> and how did you feel about <laughs> it after spending? Uh, too much money how do you feel oh yes yeah. sometimes i feel that uh, i feel that i spend a lot of money i feel uh, worries or or no worries i feel um i hope you say a, a, when you feel a conscient when you feel that you guilty spend, guilty yes sometimes but no no not all the time is the time stop? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <Sorry>. Cool. <laughs> all right. All right. Very good. Next one. Nelson. Hello, Nelson. Hello, teacher. Okay, Nelson. Think about an expensive thing that you bought. So, was it worth it? What you pay for it? Go. Okay. Uh, I was talking with my partner about it, and I told them that I don't like uh, exp uh, thing, no, but buy things expensive. This is only when I when I have a problem with my with my car, and. I have to buy a, a part for my car. And another thing can be a, a pair of shoes or, or when my, my son gets sick, it, it is necessary to buy medicine for, for him. It's only, only that case. But I don't like spending spend a lot of a lot of money. Time's money up. And, Time's up. Very yeah. good. Okay, Nelson. Nice. Thank you. Next Thank one. You, Let's see. Magdaleno. Hello, Magdaleno. Hello, teacher. Okay. Question number four. Chop lifting. How common is this crime in our country and how do shops try to prevent it? Go. Uh-huh. Whenever you're ready. My microphone was up. I have a lot of time speaking about that. <laughs> Come on. Okay, go ahead. Okay, teacher, actually I am not very informed about this problem, but I am see, uh, but I was seeing 
No, I was seeing um, different methods what the, 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 the markets or the stores used use for prevent that. For example, security ward, um, cameras, um, machines with sensors, and I don't know what else with chips or I don't know what is that in 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 the articles have some things for the for the machines sound when when things cross by the machines. Did you see that? Time have you seen that? <laughs> <laughs> ah and, and you give the uh, the question back. Aha uh -huh. <laughs> okay genius very good thank you all right, the last but not least, Isabel. Hello, Isabel. Are you there? Hello, hello. Isabel Hernandez, you there? Okay. I'm going to pick someone else. Jamie. Hello, Jamie. Hello. <laughs> okay, the last question is for you. If you were to open your own shop, what kind of things would you like to sell? Go. Mm, I if I if I have to open a store, I would like to sell construction materials and I like um, I like so much this kind this kind of of business. Uh, for example, when I go to the to um, for example, Freon and Vidri, I feel so happy. <laughs> <laughs> I like look the different and uh, and kind of products and the useful that can be for the home or for or, or for um, build a home or whatever that you want and um, I in this in this is time's up <laughs> all right very good very good <laughs> now guys what do you think is it easy or difficult to answer a question talking for one minute it's difficult because you have a time <laughs> and you are oh. thinking in the time and the word that you <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's difficult depends. for me. It's difficult it when you don't have arguments. Uh -huh. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> when you have a lot of vocabulary. Yeah. Okay. Who else? What do you think? It depends on the topic. Ah, very good. That's a good point. Because if, if it is a topic that for you it is easy, nice, no problem. You can even talk more. <laughs> but if it is a little bit complicated topic, mm, that's difficult. So listen, the idea of this activity, guys, is first of all, you have to um, follow your ideas. Think fast and organize your thoughts. OK, when you don't have a timer, you speak very slow and you tend to hesitate a lot. Like, um, yeah, you know, um, uh, well, and that affects your fluency. But now, because you see the timer, <laughs> you are speaking faster because you say, yeah, I need to talk fast because I have only one minute, right? Mm -hmm. So this is an exercise that everybody can do at home or in your free times, okay? Because that is going to help you a lot to improve your fluency and help you to think fast. Because one of the biggest problems that we usually have is that first we think in Spanish. Then our brain translates the information and then we speak in English. And we cannot do that. If you have a timer, you don't have the time to translate. 
So automatically you have to think in English. Now, be careful with the Spanish words because I was listening this word. Este, hmm, how can I say that in English? I mean. Yes, I mean, well, right? Let's use another one. If I want to say tambien, how can I say that? Well, as well. Two as well, also, right? Um, what was the other one? Oh, the pronunciation of this one. Build. 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 Yes. Build. So we are going to have this type of activity a little bit frequently. All right. So be ready to talk a lot, guys. That is the yes. purpose for this level. All right. It's good exercise. Good, good. <laughs> good. Yeah. <laughs> From Oops. time to time, we are going to have it. So let's be ready, okay? Now, talking about the distribution channels, right? We already talked about choppings and all those things. Now, the distribution channels, you already have the idea what is that. So I need a volunteer, please, for reading this short paragraph. Me? Yes, please. Okay, distribution channels. It is the network of the business or intermediaries through which a good or service passes until it reach the final buyer or the end consumers. Very good. So remember, what is the first step? Well, let's create a product. When you create a product, you need to sell it. You can sell it to the wholesaler, the wholesaler sometimes sell it to the retailer stores. And finally, the product get to the customers. So distribution channels are all the steps that the products needs to go through until they reach the customer, okay? Is it clear the idea of the distribution channels? Yes? Yes, clear. Okay. Now, I need another volunteer, please, for reading the second paragraph. Teacher? Yes, please. <laughs> distribution channel can include wholesaler. Wholesaler. Whole, whole, wholesalers. Wholesalers. Whole Thank you. Seller. Retailers. Whole distributor 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 and even the internet okay can you give me examples of these distribution channels it can sell wholesalers retailer or retailer stores they um, can be distributors you know personal selling and even on internet internet can be a distribution channel so can you give me examples of distribution channels with specific names? Or Amazon. Amazon. Amazon, definitely. What else? Alibaba. Marketplace. Marketplace. I, I heard. Very good. So what else? You are telling me only on internet, but what about the physicals? Another distribution channel? Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, no. Mm-hmm. Super selector. Yes. Cool. So you see, all of those are distribution channels. Okay. And that's what we are going to discuss now. We're going to have a quick dialogue, but before that, let's check the vocabulary that we are going to see in that dialogue. Entrepreneur, what is that? No translation, meaning. What is that? An what? entrepreneur, uh, excuse me. No, oh, continue, continue. Oh. Okay, an entrepreneur is, uh, is, is who is who start the uh, little businesses. They start with, for example, um, a short store, a little store in their, uh, oh, with, I am, I am thinking in Spanish. 
<laughs> ah, you need the timer, don't you? Yes, I need that. <laughs> okay. And the situation is the entrepreneur is is people who have a little business. For example, the the market. For example, a pharmacy. For example, uh, um, a farmer who who sells their products. They are entrepreneur. And that's correct. Teacher. Yes. I found uh, uh, some different meaning. It's a person who identifies a need in the marketplace and works to fulfill it. Actually, they are the same. Imagine, just imagine if you go to the supermarket he, uh, there in your city and you see that in the supermarket, they don't sell uh, coffee, for example. So what do you say? Hey, here they don't sell coffee. I should do that. So you start thinking in an idea and you say, yeah, let's do it. You start a new small business and then you are start growing and growing and growing and then you are successful, okay? That is the meaning of this word. Is it clear? Yes? yes? Okay. Consultant. What is that? Uh, I guess is when you hire, hire someone that could be a person or company that can give you a service, for example, a target investigation or another or another um, service. Yes, good. Exactly, so these, remember, imagine that you have your business, but you are not an expert. What do you need? You need a consultant. A consultant is a person that is an expert in some specific areas. So this person will give you advice, okay? Now- The, the, the idea is that okay, the, some of the people some the people uh, they give suggestions for the company and different process and sales, manufacturing, mm -hmm. uh, accountant. Yes, imagine they are experts in different areas, so they will give you their opinion. They will help you in order to uh, help you to take or to make good decisions. Okay. Now, Miss, yes, is is uh, the people uh, coach for different ways of uh, entrepreneur or, or uh, business? Yes, coaching. But is different, remember different that way? coaching it's more like um, uh, how can I say that with the emotions, you know, to to help you to deal in with some stressful situations, to deal mm. in, in different area. Consultant, okay. I mean, you can take it in both areas, mm -hmm. right? In the emotional, that is more like coaching, and in the business area, but they oh. are both the same. The same receive the same name, consultant. Okay. Remember, okay. consultant. There are a lot of areas. If you want to improve your business, you need a consultant. If you want to improve your health, you need a consultant. If you want to do exercise, you need a consultant. So consultant is a person that is an expert in an area and that person can give you advice. That's all, okay? Now we have the next word, through. Through is a preposition. So what is that? I believe uh, it's... Uh-huh. Jamie, please. Please, Jamie. Uh, uh, I'm going to give a little opinion. Uh, it's like a channel. It's a, I, I understand that it's a, a channel. Mm, oh or a way to reach on or read something? Yeah, we can use it in that scenario too. What else? 
Any other idea about through? Through is synonymous of passing by, teacher. Actually, they are, yes. Just imagine, guys, that here is your home. Well, let me let me try to draw in. Okay. <laughs> this is your home. And this is you. And you want to go to home. But there is a river. And there is a forest. And here there is a street. What do you need to do if you want to get home? Do you need to go through the forest, the river, and the street to get to your home? That is the meaning of through. It's passed by, across, they are synonyms, okay? Clear the meaning? Yes. Okay. Next one, me neither. Can you give me it's an example? Like a, uh -huh. It's like a, a negative answer. Yes. Imagine if I say, I like pizza. Can you answer with me neither? Yes or no? No. <laughs> no. No, right? And if I say, I don't like sushi, can you answer with me neither? Me yes. neither. Yeah, that's the one. Excellent. Partnership. What is that? Uh huh. Partnership. It's when in your business you have a partnership. It's a, when you have a, another person that's interested in your business and and have to and work together. That's it. Yes. Basically, partnership is another person that is there for you working together. That's all. Cool. Retailer stores. What is that? They are they are the stores. Please you you men first. Retailer store is that? Right? It's, it's just it's, it's distribution channel. Exactly, it's a distribution store. channel, yes. So retailer stores, guys, are lo those like Super Selectos, uh, the ones that you find in the malls, those are retailer stores. Now, if I say, hey guys, let's give a try. What is that, what do you think? You have an opportunity, right? Yes, that is the one. And the last one, success. What is the meaning of that? Success. When you when Find you sell. <laughs> okay, Mirna, what do you say? Oh, sorry. When you sell the that you expect in your budget and you plan for example, success. Okay, cool. I listen you, to, uh, to someone else. Uh huh. When you reach your objective. Very good. Yes, you reach your goals, you get what you expected, you get what you want. That is success. All right. Is it clear, everybody, this vocabulary? Yes? Yes. Okay. If you have a question, please Sorry, tell me. Uh -huh. Sorry, Miss. How do you pronounce the first? Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Yeah. Entrepreneur. Yes. Entrepreneur. Okay. And some people, if you listen to different accents, uh, accents, sorry, some people say entrepreneur. So, but they are just the same. It's depending on the access. Now, reading. I need to volunteer for reading. Who wants to read? I want to read. <laughs> Me too. Okay, I heard like three people at the same time. But give yeah. me the give me the names because if you say me, I don't know who say Rosalina. that. Rosalina and someone else. Give me the name. <laughs> Only one, please. I need someone Magdaleno. else. Magdaleno. Magdaleno. Okay, thank you. Okay, let me open up. This is on your manuals. So guys, if you have your manuals, let's go to the page number nine. Here we got Ellie and Joel. They are talking about options to distribute the product. So Rosalina, you will be Ellie. Magdaleno, you will be Joel. 
Go ahead. Okay. I am thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Magdaleno? Your microphone. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. It's the same old story. <laughs> okay, really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. Consultant. I don't have any experience with, this, with distribution options. We sell everything directly to the consumer through, through our, line, our online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give it a try. And if, and if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at stores. All right, thank you. Did you pay attention in the reading? Yes? Yes. What, what is she yes. trying to sell? Physical oh, copies of audio training. Ah, <laughs> okay. How does Ellie want to expand, expand, I'm sorry, their business according to the reading? Through so our line store. Okay. No. Well, she wants to sell copies, right? Yeah. Through the online stores. That's great. Do Joel and Ellie have experience with indirect distribution channels? What do you no. think? No. No. No, no they don't have. They don't, right? And what indirect distribution uh, distribution channels are they considering? Online store. Okay. And, and then you... catalog store. Very good. Very good job. Excellent. So always talking about these distribution channels. Here we got the vocabulary. Again, this is on your manuals, page nine. I have here this vocabulary, retailer, consultant, distributor, wholesaler, manufacturer's representative. So everybody, I just want you to match the terms with their corresponding meaning, okay? You have three minutes to complete this exercise and then we are going to see the answers. Three minutes, go ahead. Teacher, how do you pronounce the second word and the number one? Interme intermediary, intermediary. That one, yes? Yes, yes is oh, that. Very good. Teacher, what's many the words bulk and the first the number ones uh, the word what which word uh, the the word is a bulk this an, an intermediary entity in the distribution channel that buys in oh in bulk mm, i don't want to translate it let me think about the meaning how can I explain that? Okay, bulk is basically like a lot, like um, most of the parts of this. For example, the channels that buys in bulk means channels that buys in a lot of quantity or a large quantity. I don't know if it is clear. Yes, a little bit. So, 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 so. Well, basically, it's como mayor, una mayor parte, una gran mayoría. So, buying bulks is just like comprar en una gran cantidad, right? So, that will be una, the meaning. Una, 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 como un buen salvador, una gran compra, así. Ajá, 
un montón. Un montón. <laughs> yeah, basically that. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Google Translate said, says a granel. In both. And what is that? What is a granel? I'm sorry, I have never heard that a, word in a Spanish. Granel, a granel in Spanish is when you when you bought something uh, without packages. For example, oh. when you when you bought rice and um, beans in a sack. Ah, okay. Big quantities. Makes, makes sense because remember, guys. I mean, in simple words, when you say buy in a bulk. It's just a synonym of wholesalers or wholesales. Mayoreo. Uh huh. Basically that. Yeah. Okay. If you have a question, just let me know. One more minute. One more minute. You ready, everybody? No yet. Okay. If you have a question, just let me know, please. Read carefully. Try to analyze the definition so you can pick the correct word. Let me know when you finish. Ready, everybody? I'm ready. Yes. Okay. The rest of you guys, are you ready? Yes, no, miss. Ready. Yes? No? No yet. No yet. Okay. One more minute, and then we are going to check the answers. For everybody, one more minute, and then we check the answers. Be careful. Try to read carefully the answers, please. Okay, let's see the answers. Number one, I need a volunteer for reading the definition number one. Only one, please. Teacher. Thank you, go ahead. An, an intermediary entity in the distribution channel that buys in bulk and sells to resellers. Thank you. What do you think, guys? What is that? 
Wholesale. Distributor. Distributor. Yes. Wholesaler. Wholesalers. Uh -huh. Any other idea? I think that is wholesaler. Are you sure? Imagine that this is your exam. Oh my God. <laughs> in my opinion, is in my opinion is a wholesaler. Okay. In my opinion too. In your opinion too. Ready? Probably. So, oh. are you pretty sure with your life? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. And, and, life. and when I when I say with your life, everybody's like, "What? Wait, no." <laughs> uh, can you see the screen? I'm sorry. I I don't know if I'm sharing. Can you see what I'm sharing? Yes. Not to you. Right no. now. Yeah, I'm sorry. What happens? Uh, how about now? Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. Very good. And yes, wholesaler. So you got one point and you continue alive. <laughs> Look, uh, as we said, buys in bulk means like in a large quantity, right? A lot of things. So that is the same of wholesaler. Now, number two, volunteer for reading. Thank you, please go ahead. And I uh, uh, hint the poor supplier would do a store and other business that sell to consumer. Thank you. Okay, pronunciation, agent. 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 And if agent. I have business in plural, what will be the pronunciation? Agent. Okay, agent, yes. Agent. But Business. Business is in singular. If I have in plural, what is the pronunciation? Businesses. 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 Correct. Okay. Thank you, Oscar. So everybody, what do you think? What is the answer in the number two? It's a distributor. 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 My opinion is a distributor. Okay. Yes. And the rest of you guys, what do you think? Oh, I, yes, I think yeah. that is manufacturer representative. I think it's manufacturer mm -hmm. representative too. Uh -huh. ah. <laughs> <laughs> and this is your exam. So <laughs> I am died. <laughs> With your life or not? Oh. <laughs> yes. With my life, oh, with my life by the on, the on the neck, <laughs> on the neck. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this is distributor. So what is a distributor? Distributor is an agent, okay? This person is the one who supplies with the products. This person takes the product to the stores or to other business, right? To sell to the customers, okay? Now, uh, number three, I need a volunteer, please, for reading number three. Me? Yes, please. A person or business that sell goods to the public in small quantities for use. Thank you. So what is that, guys? It is retail. Retailer. 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 Are you sure? Yes. Yes, yes. yes. yeah. <laughs> With your life? Yes. yes. No. With my life and yours. <laughs> And some people say, yeah, anyway, <laughs> right? Okay. Number four, volunteer for reading. Me. Yes, please go ahead. A professional who provides expert advice in a particular area such as distribution, distribution logistics. Thank you. Aha, uh -huh. what is that? Consultant. Yes, a consultant. It's a consultant. Are you sure? Yes, this yeah. is <laughs> Of course, right? Of course. Nice, very good. You are alive. Okay, the last one. Volunteer for reading, please. I want to. Yes, please go ahead. An individual, is that the pronunciation of individual? Yes. Okay, an individual agency or company that sells. A manufacturer's product, products to wholesale and retail customers. 
retail customers. Mm -hmm. So what is that? Yes, it's the last one. <laughs> the last. That is the last one. Last okay. One. Imagine that this is your exam. Will you uh, will you pass the exam? No. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. Okay. Some people say one, yes. One. Some people or say 60, no. 60, 60, 60. <laughs> okay. Some some people need to study more. We are going to send them to intermediate three for a couple of days. <laughs> ah, be careful okay super good be careful with this vocabulary remember guys you have exercises on the platform and sometimes on the platform you can see this vocabulary so keep it in mind okay now let's continue with some vocabulary always talking about uh, distribution channels so i have here six words after sales service guarantee period, retail, wholesale, supplier, and competitor, okay? So we need to match these words with the next sentences. So read carefully. Again, I will give you five minutes and you have to decide which word goes with the correct sentence, okay? Another exam. So let's see if you pass this one. Okay, go ahead. If you have a question, just let me know. Five minutes. Go ahead. Teacher, the pronunciation of the first word is a company. Oh, I'm sorry. A company is, is my mistake. Give me a second. I'm going to fix it. <laughs> uh, a company. <laughs> okay. Sorry, my bad. I am getting like just Chinese. Okay, this we are. So this is the correct one. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> Can you see the presentation? Yes? Yes, yes, yes. Excellent, okay. If you have a question, just let me know, please. Read carefully.
Let me know when you finish. I'm finished, teacher. Excellent. Who else? Did you finish, guys? Yes, I'm finished. Yes. yes? All right. Yes. Okay, cool. So let's see the answers. And again, another exam, guys. A company or a person that provides a particular type of product. What is that? Supplier. 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 Are you sure? Yes. With your life? <laughs> yes. Ah, very good. Your confidence is improving now. Very good. <laughs> and that's what I like, guys. Confidence. Okay. You need a lot of confidence. Okay. Number two, volunteer for reading. Can I do so? Yes, please. Help, advice, or free repairs that you get after you buy a product. Thank you. What is that, guys? After sales service. After sales service. Are you sure? Yes. yes. Ah, very good. Exactly. After sales service. Perfect. Volunteer for reading, number three. Yes, teacher. Yes, please. A person who tries to be more successful than you. Thank you. What is that? Definitely, right? <laughs> Do you have competitors at work? Yes. yes. <laughs> Definitely, right? Excellent. Okay, next one. Number four, volunteer for reading. Teacher. Yes, please. The selling of the good to bosonize usually in the large quantity. Thank you. Businesses. Okay. That's the pronunciation in plural. Businesses. Okay. Business size. That's the one. Aha, uh -huh, guys. What is that? Whole storage. Wholesale. 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 Very good. Very good. Number five, volunteer. Me. Yes. Go ahead. When the seller, time when the seller repairs or replace a product free of cherry. Charge. 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 Uh -huh. What is that, guys? Warranty period. Warranty period. Guarantee period. Good. And the last one, volunteer for reading. Yes, please. The selling of gold, the public usually strong shop. Thank you. What is that, guys? Retail. Retail. Yeah. Definitely. So I think that these definitions were easy, right? Did you pass the exam this time? Yes. Yes? Everybody? Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's the idea. So be careful with the vocabulary. Tomorrow, I will ask you the vocabulary. So I expect you Keep in mind that, okay? Any question about these words? No? Are you sure? Okay, very good. Before continue, I need to check attendance again. So everybody, when you listen to your names, say present. Adriana Escalante? Present. Very good. Carlos Abrego? Present, teacher. Okay, Christian Alexander. Present Okay, Erika Yasmin. Present. Okay, Fatima Denise. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Germán eh, Durán. Present teacher. Okay, Héctor Francisco. Present. Okay, Isabel Hernández. Present, Miss. Okay, Iván Guzmán. Present. Okay. Jamie Raquel. Present. Okay. Holman Giron. Present. Okay. Lucy Natalie. Present. Okay. Magdalena Escalante. Present. Okay. Mirna Elizabeth. Present. All right. Nelson Antonio. Present. 
Okay. Oscar Armando. Present. Okay. And Rosalina Alvarado. Present. All right, very good. Okay, let's continue. Always talking about the distribution channels. There is a new distribution channel that is covering a lot and it's internet. So guys, tell me, do you buy online or do you prefer to go to the retail stores? Online. Online. Okay. Why online and why the retail stores? Uh huh. Why do In you prefer? It's cheaper than than go to a store for me. It's cheaper. Mm, okay. Good point. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The ones that prefer to go in person to the store, why? Why do you prefer that instead of buying online? I prefer in person. Why? Because, because you can choose, for example, size. And you can choose the things that you can buy. Okay. Very good, very good. Anyone else? Do you prefer to buy online or in person? Is the, the product t-shirt? Sorry. Sorry. Why? Which products do you prefer to buy online? For example, for home products. Okay. How about clothes? Clothes? No. I Because I need to try to wear the, the size or maybe the colors or something like that. I, I, I don't know. But maybe the size is more important when you when you try it or when you wear it, it's not is you look different. <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah. yeah, very good. Okay, so that is what we are going to talk right now. So we are going to go again to the um Breaking rooms, you are going to discuss these questions to your classmates. So remember, in this case, the distribution channel is internet, okay? Those uh, online stores. I'm sending the questions again on WhatsApp's group. Let me know if you can see the questions. Yes? Yes. Excellent. Yes, Very good. Okay, let me just create the groups. Give me a moment. Okay, just a moment, please. Okay, very good. So everybody, let's go to the breaking rooms. Everybody enter, please. Okay, and remember the rules, zero Spanish. Let's go. Hello, partners. Hello, Ivan. Hello, my friend Hector. Hello, How are you? Hello. Hello. Okay. Hello. Answer the question. I, All the I, questions. I, okay, I, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Jamie, go ahead. I can share. The first, the first question is, yes. when was the last time you purchased something online? Why did you buy in online and not a real shop? Mm. 
when was the last time you purchased purchased mm -hmm. something online? Um, in my case, in my in my opinion, um, the first I remember shoes shoes buy and online in uh, in it was a beauty beauty shoes for me because it's very it's cheaper and good quality and i don't find that did not find the past <laughs> uh, the uh, find in the in in the store national store this product why did you buy online and not in a real shop because this situation is is cheaper and have a good quality but it's necessary have a, a it's careful careful for for buy the the good the good um because it shoots for me. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. I I remember uh, I bought I bought uh, a book. The book book a book. No, book. book book book. I bought book. Um. The topic the book is uh I don't remember. Um the topic is Christians. Really? The topic is Christian. The name is um um I don't remember. Well okay. The theme, the theme, uh, do you remember the, the theme, the, the situation for this book? Maybe uh, it's history. If it, if it, if it lie, uh, I buy. Yeah. If it's online, but no. Mm -hmm. uh, um, online, you cannot, uh, uh, you buy. Uh, you no can see uh, the product in physical. Mm -hmm. Yes, good point. Uh, um, okay. I prefer the physical product uh, I can see. Aha, uh -huh. physical. Yeah. Okay, the next one. What do you know about Amazon? Amazon. Yep. The workplace. The company stars similar to I think it's, it's online, no? Uh, yes, it's online. online. Mm -hmm. the, but uh, Amazon is, con, is, is more complex. Uh, I have uh, the, around the world the, uh, how much product or uh, the, the um, Around the world, mm -hmm. workplace is different. It's, it's or country local, no, no Amazon, no Amazon. I talked to Lucy about the. For me, the problem it was in Amazon. The cost to the shipping, because in our country don't have a, a representative for Amazon. You need to pay a. I don't know, I, I say in, in, in English, but you need to pay another people and mm -hmm. the people has a, a, a box uh, in the in United States and then you take a product. For me, uh, it's an obligation to use that because for the reason for my son, we need to buy the suit for swimming, competition swimming, and that in our country don't have any products about this and then I need to use. You have we online have... store in Facebook? Yes, I have. What kind? Have... <laughs> ah. what, what, what kind of that... store? What do you have? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I sell fish. 
fish. Ah, yes, ah. I sell fish in, in Facebook. Oh, nice. Uh, actually, yeah. it's a good market. Yes. Oh, really? Yes, it's a good market. You sell, you sell for marketplace or just in your profile? In my profile. Oh. Yeah, because you 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 have a lot of people that follow you because you are a pastor or in the I have a, maybe I have a profile for my for my for my business. Oh. Is from from the lake to the to the table is in Spanish, of course. From to the lake to the table. Is it the name that you your own business? Yes. Oh, in Facebook. <laughs> yes, is is that oh. you can see that? Is that? Oh, nice. Can you see? Ah, the lago a la mesa. Yeah. From the lake to the table. From the lake to the table. It's a good name. It's an original name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, you can <laughs> sell online, and I have delivery. But which lake is the which yes. lake is the but yes, which is Lopango. Casillero. Uh -huh. It's really common right now. Me too. I, I I know a little bit about Amazon, but I have never bought anything in the place. <laughs> a friend have the facility to to buy in this place. They buy a lot of things. She buy a lot of things. And that that is is good <laughs> have a, a good product okay time's up let's go back again to the main room time's up time's up let's go back Okay, we are going to wait for your classmates. There are some people still on the breaking rooms. All right. Easy or difficult the questions? What do you think? Uh huh. Hey, for us, interesting topic. And then uh, we, we need to improve the words in English for, for express the opinion. It's nice. Ah, okay, that's great. Very, practice, yeah. Very good. Remember guys, I know that maybe this is not a topic like very interesting for everyone, but if I give you easy topics, I mean, for you will be easy to answer the questions, but if it is a different topic, maybe it isn't, something out of your comfort zone. So we don't have more time. So very quickly, please. Our country don't have, is that correct? No. Don't has. Don't, don't has. Find, doesn't. Doesn't have. Doesn't have. Oh doesn't. my goodness. <laughs> don't Go care. back to basic one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. People has. Huh? Ah, very uh -huh. good. A friend. Because it's better, right? Yes, mm -hmm. that's correct. A friend have. Has. has. Okay, has. everybody. Their person. Their person. What happens? Come on. So, mistakes with their person in this point, at this level. Come on, let's try to avoid it. Be careful with that. Now, we don't have more time. We are going to continue tomorrow. You look. You look so beautiful, guys, with your camera on. So I expect that during the whole course, not just today, but the full classes. Now, as always, at the end of the class, there is a winner that has to stay. And today's winner is Adriana. <laughs> so everybody, you can go to sleep. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Don't Thank forget you. to work okay. on the platform. Okay. Thank goodbye, nice. goodbye. Bye -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, bye. bye. Only Adriana stays, please. The rest of you go to sleep. Goodbye, goodbye. See you tomorrow. Okay. Hello, Adriana. How are you?
Hi, I'm really good. I'm happy to be here again. <laughs> That's great. You are not in troubles. Don't worry. Okay. <laughs> this yes, meeting, <laughs> yeah, this meeting is just to clarify some questions that you may have about the class, about the course, or any comments that you may have. So, I'm just here for you. <laughs> so, how can I help okay. you? Mm -hmm. I just have one question. Uh, we talk uh, and the, at the beginning of the class, you talk about a platform. Mm -hmm. but I don't have access to the platform yet. I don't know if the course is already open. Well, it must be, it must be already opened um, because look at this, this is the one, okay? Wait until tomorrow. If tomorrow you don't have the access, let me know. So we are going to find out what is happening, okay? Yes. But. Okay. Yeah, it must be opened already. Um, but you have the user, you have the uh, password, everything? Yes, it's, the thing here is that it's not my first time in this course ah. because I studied the last year on December and ah, then okay. I don't have the opportunity to continue with the classes but now I get I'm here again <laughs> ah very yeah. good so welcome so, back <laughs> yes, thank you so I I have the cruises of the last year but I don't have this one so ah. that is that's where I ask yeah okay <laughs> so check tomorrow if it doesn't appear or if you don't have access yet you can take a screenshot and send it to me so I can report it and they will give you the access okay, okay. yeah perfect Thank okay, you. very well. Any other questions that you may have? Yes, that's all. Okay, how Thanks do you feel you. with this with this group? I'm great. <laughs> <laughs> I think that we have a lot of talkative person. <laughs> they are, they are. And uh, I know you weren't with us because we were together in the previous course. So uh, I don't want you to feel like out of the, the group. I want it to be like, part of the group so they are very friendly as you see they are very talkative not all the time but most of the time there are some days that they don't want to talk maybe because they are tired but yeah, yeah. I just want you to feel that you are welcome in this group and be confident that if you have a question or if you don't understand something just let us know I will help you I'm totally able to explain again if there is a topic, I know that you didn't have the opportunity to study during the previous months. So sometimes yes. that affects because it's like we have a past, but if you need something, just let me okay. know, okay? Thank you. Thank Great. you, teacher. <laughs> uh, I don't pleasure. know if you have any other comment. No, that's all yeah. for me. Excellent. Okay, just Thank a feedback you. for you. I can see that you are participating a lot. That's something that I really like. You have the camera on during the class. Thank you a lot. So please okay. keep going. Don't change that during the course. Okay? okay. Okay. Excellent. Okay, let's stop here. Thank you, Adriana. Have a good night and see you tomorrow. Good night. Goodbye. Bye. See you.